Hello friends, let's talk about something that could change the way money moves in India. Not UPI this time, but artificial intelligence, which is AI. The Reserve Bank of India has just rolled out a framework for free AI. Framework for responsible and ethical enablement of AI. Sounds fancy, right? But here is the point. AI is already deciding who gets a loan, who's flagged for fraud, and even who gets faster customer service. The RBI now wants to make sure those decisions are fair, explainable and trustworthy. Think of it as a traffic rule book for AI in finance. Until now, banks and fintechs were using AI more like trial and error. With free AI, the rules are clear. No black boxes, no hidden biases and no excuses. The framework rests on seven big principles. Fairness, responsibility, transparency, accountability, safety, contestability and explainability. Sounds like values your grandmother would approve of, but they are now becoming a compliance requirements. If an algorithm rejects your loan tomorrow, you will have the right to challenge the decision and the bank will need to explain why. Now this isn't just about controlling risk, it's also about building India's own AI infrastructure, Bharat AI. Imagine credit scoring in local languages chatbots that actually understand dialects and low bandwidth tools that work in rural areas. That's the kind of leap RBI is nudging towards. Of course, it won't be easy. Banks will need to invest in governance, training and data cleaning. Fintechs will have to build systems that can pass audits, but the payoff is big. Stronger trust, better decision making and fewer regulatory headaches down the line. Free AI isn't a roadblock, it's a runway. If done right, India won't just adopt AI in finance, it will set the gold standard for ethical AI worldwide. This is BFSI show by DTBFSI.com. Thanks for watching.